Such large drones are actually assembled by young women, can you believe it? I am taking everyone to visit a real underground drone factory, literally on basement level 1. Let's first introduce the components. This is the power distribution board for an octocopter drone. The battery plugs into this bottom port, and the power is divided into 9 parts, 8 are routed to the motors, and 1 powers the flight controller, data transmission, and other systems. For a hexacopter, the power distribution board is square-shaped. This row here is for ASCIIs, which are used in small drones. This is the flight controller developed by Yilis. There are also various motor models. Small motors are for small octocopters, while eight large motors are used for medium-sized heavy lift drones. The X9, a high-power motor, can easily handle a payload of up to 25 kilograms. Other components include carbon rods, propellers, landing gear, and more. Next, let's take a look at the processing area. The main challenge here is soldering the motor and S together. After soldering, the assembly undergoes testing to ensure functionality. Once tested, sealant is applied for waterproofing. The S key is then clipped into a slot, a thermal silicone pad is attached, the bottom cover is fastened, and the screws are tightened, completing the motor assembly. A freshly assembled drone looks like this. Do you know why the two front arms are red? What equipment is used in a drone factory? The first is a machining center, used for drilling holes in carbon rods, with very high precision. The second is a tapping machine, which is used to create threads in metal parts. For example, if the outer wall is too thick, it can be thin. If the length is too long, it can be shortened. There's also a marking machine used to make ID cards for drones by printing equipment information on nameplates. The last piece of equipment is one you are all familiar with. The assembled drone looks like this. It can carry devices like gimbal cameras, loudspeakers, or drop mechanisms. When the left rotating propellers are running, airflow directly dissipates heat via heat sinks. This ensures long duration, continuous flights with excellent performance. What other factories do you want to see? Follow us and let us know what you'd like to source.